Hi there, I'm Pud Kearns with Housewarmers of Greenville, and I've been asked by eExtra News to talk about, as a local here in town, what are some of the places that I would take friends that were coming to visit me from out of town? And the very first place that I would start would be right here at Ain't Just Pie. And why? If nothing else, just because of some of the best pie you'll ever have anywhere. Ain't Just Pie is owned by a mother-daughter team. They have won all kinds of national awards uh, for their pies. One of their pies, the Lemon Chess, was named the best of show at the State Fair of Texas a few years ago. And it is absolutely wonderful with that sharp lemon flavor. These are pies with serious credentials. They have other things as well. They have quiche, they have good sandwiches, they serve breakfast in the morning. It's a great place to just kind of start. Another place that I would take my friends if they were coming to Greenville would be here at Landon Winery. I love both the wine and the great atmosphere here. And we're in the barrel room right now, which the first Saturday of every month, uh, Bob Landon, who is the owner of the winery, does a terrific tour of the place. And you actually get to tap the wine barrels and you get to taste some of the wine that's in process. He works so hard to educate you about wine and about how it tastes and about how to learn how to drink it. It is just so much fun. And then the actual winery rooms and the um, patio are wonderful in the evenings. They have live music on the weekends. The patio is a wonderful place when the weather is nice to sit out and enjoy a bottle of wine, have a good visit. So everything about this place to me is, is just very special, including how great the wine is. So other places that I would take people if they came to Greenville, um, I think that the public art in downtown is very exciting and very dynamic right now. And I would do a walking tour with my friends that would show them some of the interesting pieces of art. There's several interactive ones that are a lot of fun with kids. Uh, I would also take them to see the Texan Theater, which is such a beautiful restoration. Uh, the Audie Murphy American Cotton Museum is a delightful place. Yes, it has Audie Murphy and some of the history, but it has so many surprises there that I think are wonderful. And all in all, I think that would make a fun day of learning that Greenville is a very special place, and it's certainly near and dear to my heart. So I ask you, if you had people that were coming to Greenville, where would you take them? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and it'll be fun to see what your opinions are.